let me turn off this vacuum pump. Been a little distracted in the shop. I just got through building this vacuum infuser. Basically, as I was going through my inlay series, it occurred to me that I'd like to have the capability of making my own dyed veneer. I really like using these different colored veneers, especially the earth colors, um, like this green veneer that I'm using for a leaf. I did a little research and I found some plans and ideas as inspiration and I came up with this bench top vacuum infuser. Basically, I had all the materials here in my shop. This is a square piece of scrap cherry. I mounted a four inch PVC pipe cap with a foam gasket and screws that are sealed with silicone. A piece of four inch PVC pipe is secured into the uh, cap with silicone. The top is removable. It's another piece of, um, oh, I'm sorry, another piece, another uh, PVC cap. The center is drilled out to accept this inflating nozzle. And on the inside is a ring of gasket material which forms a vacuum tight seal. When this is put on, it goes on real nice and easy, which is something I like. It draws a nice vacuum. It holds it without any leaks and it's easily removed. Inside I have a smaller container and you could stack four or five of these up of different colors um, or later on I plan on building an insert out of three inch PVC pipe to take, uh, this will take up to 24 inch piece of veneer as long as you want rolled up into a thin roll and then slid down inside the pipe. But inside here is a sample that I made. You can just put a cap on this and use it for the next piece of veneer. I've got four bottles of trans tint dye that I've made up. Orange, yellow, green, and uh, amber. So this is just a piece of cherry that is infused with orange dye. It's a nice even color and that's the cherry before the dye. I also did a piece of green. Now you can change these colors by changing the intensity of the um, dye and um, I think you'll find this is a pretty simple and easy project that will add a lot of capabilities to your shop. Some other things you can do with this, um, you can infuse uh, there we go. wood stabilizing products such as um, thin acrylics or in this case Minwax wood hardener. And again, you would just pour the wood hardener into a suitable container, put your wood in, put it in the vacuum infuser, put the lid on, draw a vacuum. It takes for this veneer literally five to ten minutes to uh, vacuum infuse it. For infusing stabilizing products, you're going to have to experiment, but I would imagine you'd want to draw a vacuum for several hours um, and then give it, a, give it a try and see how it works. Anyway, pretty simple project, and um, I'll draw some plans and post some pictures on the blog. Thank you.